All right, let's fucking. I don't need to talk to her. Yeah, talk to her and see if I. I swear she can tell you about herself. No, nope, says okay, thanks. What do you think we need to do next? And then it's like I'm forgetting. So it's it's literally just, she's just uh, like where I need to go next. Okay. I have a fuck ton of meat nuggets. Let's go, Ghost. So so can is there anywhere northwestish you can go? Let's see. Not yet. Okay. Unless this whole area is just completely here just to be here. Oh no, you'll get to go there eventually. <laughs> All right, so to the Snake Spring then. Okay. I really like the, like, the sound of hoofbeats. Ooh. You notice a campsite off in the distance that appears to have been very comprehensively trampled to ruin. Go, go there, then. Go there now! Oh, hooray! I guess we'll just go to Snake Springs in a minute. Okay. This knapsack seems like it's taken a lot of abuse recently. This nap, let's see. Most of the contents are thrash, are trashed from being stomped on. You do find a dented can of potted meat, though. You also notice that the knapsack has a knife sheath strapped to the side, but you don't see the knife anywhere. You had potted meat. And this tent is a real mess. It looks like it was trampled by a whole herd of cows. There's something odd about it. It kind of looks like a body. This campfire has been thoroughly stomped on and kicked. Someone was real serious about fire safety. Yikes, you think, maybe, this used to be a person? Let's take it. What a mess cows did to this guy. Cows did this to a guy? Mm. Oh, oh, I'm supposed to be... Okay. Yeah, 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 you're supposed to be fucking taking part. I <laughs> reckon so, judging from these tracks, but... Hmm. What's wrong? Something about these tracks ain't quite right. What do you mean? They aren't spaced out right, and they're uneven. Okay, what does that mean? I'd say either the cow that made these tracks was drunk, or it wasn't a cow that made them. Hmm. Ow. <laughs> There are cow tracks leading away from the mangled corpse. It probably wouldn't be hard to follow. Okay. follow the tracks. Since you have reason to believe these tracks may be a fake, you could either follow them or head in the opposite direction. We're following the tracks. Oh, well, but if, if if they're a fake, then maybe they're trying to lead you away from where they went, so you could go the opposite Let's way. Let's go the opposite direction. You head in the opposite direction for about half a mile and discover another campsite! This one occupied. You observe the campers carefully from a distance before approaching. They're dressed weirdly in brightly colored baggy clothes and white face paint. Oh no! As you get closer, you realize they're dressed up as rodeo clowns. Oops. Why would they do that? There doesn't seem to be a rodeo happening anywhere near here. Shall we approach? Yeah, okay. <laughs> God damn it, we've encountered the fucking the demon clowns. Oh, yes. Something that's... Oh. Shall we say hello? This rodeo clown is playing a harmonica. The tune he's playing basically goes doot doot doodle oodle oot doot doo doo. Doot doot doodle oodle oot doot. God damn it! Yep. <laughs> I was trying not to do anything. Yeah. He nods politely but keeps playing. Alright. This rodeo clown is eating a comically large haunch of meat. He narrows his eyes at you as if to say, Whoa. This road this clown is idly juggling a knife. Howdy, stranger! He says with a smile. Well, oh, oh yeah, go check the whole game. This is a simple three-man tent, which probably sleeps about 40 clowns. <laughs> okay, that, that's all it is. Converse! Howdy, stranger! Uh, howdy! Let's see. Maybe the knife? I don't know. Do you know anything about that wrecked camp nearby? The clown with the meat chuckles quietly. Oh, it looks like... Mm, so do we... Do we... We can, we can play dumb for a bit. Oh, it looks like the work of cows. Yeah. Well, it looks like the work of... Cows. You know, now that you mention it, we did hear quite a ruckus coming from that not too far away. A lot of, you know, mooing and so on, right boys? The other two clowns nod in agreement. Well, you guys know a lot about cows, right? <laughs> Damn. Now, why would you assume that? Just because we're clowns? Well, I figure it comes with the territory. It's been a good 20 years since a rodeo was an actual thing, you know? So why do you dress that way? Dress? Oh. Well, it's traditional, after all. Isn't it inconvenient? How do you mean? Makeup and baggy clothes and all. 
You might say you were used to it. Taking it off would be more convenient, right, fellas? The other two clowns chuckle. Well, it must be hard to talk to people when they're all creeped out. Oh, do you think we're creepy? He leers at you, showing yellow teeth. In the flickering light of the campfire, they almost look pointed. Uh, haha! <laughs> Relax, partner! That's just the old stories getting you worked up. You mean the old stories about... How demon cows and demon clowns war against each other in hell, and rodeo clowns dress like that because the rodeos were sort of like reenactment of those battles? <laughs> what?! Uh, is that actually a thing in this? Yes. So, so, so there were de so, so like ICP level demon clowns. Uh, they fought against the demon cows because, because the whole thing of the cows coming home was when demon cows infested like the world and, like, that's why the world is still in the old west. <laughs> like they killed a lot of people. Uh, You've done your homework. So what do you think? Are demon clowns real? I think I'm looking at one right now. Let's, uh, do the middle one. Well, I guess maybe. The demon clowns turned out to be real. The demon cows turned out to be real after all, so why not the clowns, too? The clown smiles, but his eyes are hard. Ew. <laughs> it's sensible to keep an open mind, but you know, stranger, if clowns did turn out to be real, this could be an awful awkward predicament you find yourself in right now, couldn't it? Awkward for you, clown. Oh, dearie dear. Well, now you go and say things like that, you know, we can't let you leave here alive, right, stranger? Damn. <laughs> Let's fucking let's fuck up some clowns. <laughs> All right, let's fucking beef up. <laughs> I forgot that we were Westernson and not Westerson. Oh, West Westernson. Westernson. Yeah. All right, I think we need to gore. Oh no, that was not the one I wanted. To Why did he only take one damage? Because that whole attack is just about doing damage in a line, and if there's nothing for him to be knocked against behind him, it, it, it's oh, pointless. Oh, shit. Yeah, it, it, it's only for enemies that are in a straight line in front of each other. <laughs> oh yeah, one of them just has a gun. Okay. Well, I guess we're just not going to use that move anymore. Uh, let's fucking fuck this bitch ass up. Yeah! Yep. I'm just going to kill him one at a time. <clears throat> Fucking attack her! God damn! I don't have any AP. Damn it. I can't heal myself with that. Deals five damage. Target will get wet. Heal. <laughs> what the fuck? Well that's a one way to use it, I guess. Oh yeah, because I can use I can use an item and then I can attack. Let's attack him. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, Annie, or Susie. Why don't you keep calling that Annie? Because, because... Annie, are you okay? Well, no, well, Annie, get your gun. Uh, that, that I actually don't know. Uh, or was it Danny, get your gun? Danny, get your gun. There's, there's an... I need to fucking... Danny Oakley. Like... Uh, yeah. Now let's break this barrel. The barrel is destroyed! Kiovich! Shoot her, please. Please stop hitting me. They gotta heal in between fights. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's one pack of rodeo clowns that won't be troubling people anymore. And boy, you did not expect to be thinking that sentence today. Look through their stuff. You poke around their campsite for a bit, but you don't find anything of value apart from the leader's knife and a ticket to the circus. Well, the harmonica, maybe, but that clown had his lips all over. You also find a note in one of the lead clown's pockets. Ew. It seems to be orders to check out an abandoned tannery not far from Dirtwater. It prob it's probably a bad idea to let these guys wander around your town, so maybe you should investigate. Shut her. You, you, you discovered Danny's tannery. Danny tannery? I didn't know Danny sex bang opened a tannery. Oh god. He really does like to tan hides. Well, that's not very nice of him. He's preparing them for being clothing. For being clothing? Clothing, yeah. <laughs> clothing. You find a flyer for a dynamite store up north. It's charred around the edges like it got blown here by an explosion. You mark the address oh, down on your map. I would really like to, like, go to the fucking area I'm trying to go to. Uh, yeah. Dynamite Dance. A year's supply of dynamite. Oh, yeah, don't we need that for the quest? Uh, so that is one <laughs> of the ways we can get it. Oh, yeah, you can also just steal it. And I would, I would much rather steal it. Well, not that's from that's this guy, but like you, so you can get it from other locations. 
we can sell. These are for selling too, right? Uh, I would keep all of the bone things because you can craft with them. Uh, and same with the laudanum, you can. Uh, these are for selling. Nope, same same thing. Really? Yep. What are these? Uh, those you can, I think. Years of being stuck in the nose of a cow has have done nothing for the finish on this thing. Yeah. What is that? For? That also crafting. Most of the items are either for crafting or for giving to other people. Alright, we don't really need anything here. Nope. We... Alright, can we fucking go here now, game? A wave of heat hits you from behind. You turn around to see a hell calf pawing the ground and eyeing you with ill intent in its dead, black, demonic eyes. Charge it! And now Susie will become Stranger. Kill it! Oh, cool. She killed her. Oh, yeah. You put out the unholy fire that animated that unfortunate doggy. Doggy. I hope I said that right. Yeah, we'll get along, little doggy. You... Is that really what that's supposed to mean? Yeah. I it's... thought it was literally them talking to a dog. No, a doggy and a doggy are not the same thing. What about a stogie? Well, that's a cigar. <laughs> what about a bogey? Well, that's uh, either a booger if you're from Britain, or it's just the word for an enemy if you're in the Air Force. You skin the cow with your trusty knife. So you carved another notch in your stock of the rifle. Thank you, I can finally go to the area I've been trying to go to this whole fucking time. Ugh. I really wish I had forgery. Or foraging so I could fucking get things. Oh! That's a lot of snakes. I, I forgot about this area. An endless stream of snakes pours out of a hole in the canyon wall. Grab a big one. Let's grab a big one. Let's just kill them. Got the- oh, y yes, I did in fact get the jump on them. I fucking grabbed the motherfucker. Let's rock and roll. Where's my AP at? Oh, yeah, I have three action points. I just want to make sure I'm strand. Yeah! Shoot it! Seemed kind of unnecessary, but okay. We got a snake spleen that just looks like broccoli. The snake doesn't put doesn't have enough skin on it for you to even bother pulling out your knife. Hooray! Let's grab a handful. The, it's just three. It's just fucking four of the same thing. Mm -hmm. So if I does it matter which one of these I hit if I hit Gore? No, uh, I think Gore only goes dead. Uh, well, yeah. Okay, let's try this. There we go! Alright. That's exactly what I wanted. Kill it! Just fucking punches you with its head. Whiff. It sniffed my nuts. They look like nothing so much as just big turds. That's not the one I wanted to hit, but okay. Oh, okay, it's dead. <laughs> Jesus Christ! You like I'll say, yeah, you you get actual XP in this. So you successfully killed four snakes out of infinity snakes. Just infinity more to go. You got a snake venom bladder and a snake liver. All right. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Is 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 this, is this literally all this is? Is just like a spring of snakes I can fight? Uh, you might be able to go past it. I, I just tried going past it, and it didn't, like... There was nothing after it? It didn't look like it. Yeah, it just looks like it's a wall. Oh, okay. Alright, then yeah. Alright, well, I guess, I guess we, we got all we wanted here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I just realized your face gets all frowny when you touch cactus. Well, yeah, because you, you just hurt yourself on a cactus. Well, maybe I wanted to do it. Why, why is that never an option? Alright. The old mission... Off to the side of the trail, you spot a beer barrel cactus. You're not sure why they call them that, since they're shaped like mugs, not barrels. I can't do anything. Yep. One day I'll be able to. Yep. Alright. I, I don't remember what the point of this area is. That's a noon. Yep. Hello, noon. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. What's wrong, sister? They came back. They just came back and took them. I couldn't stop them. Whoa, slow down. Okay. What happened? Oh, right. holy relics! The saints just stormed! The saints came marching in! <laughs> Her voice just changes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Wow. I didn't know what to do. I thought maybe they'd fire me if I tried to stop them. The Cardinal will be here any minute. What am I going to do? To start with, take a deep breath and try to calm down, okay? What's your name? I... <sighs> I'm Sister Mary. My name's West. Now, what's this about saints? They uh, came marching in! Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Our mission's, uh, uh, mission uh, is to protect three sacred relics. I'm the relic keeper. It's my specific job to look after them. Wait. Do they call you Memento Man? She shows you the ruler. She keeps tucked in her sleeve. No, they do not. Okay, okay, sorry. Memento <laughs> Mary. Memento Mary, goddammit. Yeah. So what happened? Okay. The Saints! Oh, it's too horrible! They just, they just watched it! <laughs> they just came to life somehow! They came up out of the catacombs, all skeletal and ghastly looking! I mean, it's probably blasphemy to say that, but I nearly fainted! And they took back the relics? Yes! And if they aren't recovered before the Cardinal gets here, I'll be in so much trouble! Uh-oh, how much time is there? Well, actually, he's months overdue, so probably not all that urgent, but still! Alright, I'll get them back for you. Oh, thank you! Thank you so much! Oh, wait a second. Are you going to have to fight them to get the relics back? Because that's probably blasphemous, too. Uh, I mean, boss, probably. But if black magic brought them back to life, that's like super blasphemous, right? So it evens out. Oh, dear. The Cardinal is going to want to have a very long talk about this. But go ahead and do what you must, I suppose. Okay. <laughs> yeah. It's an empty relic spot for a skull. Wait, so we just no a pelvis and a finger bone? Mm hmm. Wee. I'm crab walking. It's the Exorcist. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, there's another. Pew pew pew. God damn it. Pew pew pew. You're not a priest, so you shouldn't mess with any of this stuff. Oh. Good luck down there. Yep. Oh, okay. That's probably an infinite number of skulls I can fight. This coffin looks like it was hauled down here fairly recently. Look inside. It's, it's empty. Oh. This skull is cool, too. It's a precariously balanced pyramid of skulls. They're all riled up and twitching. Take it over. Are you sure? There's a lot of them, and they're really mad. A very angering all of them at once isn't a great idea. Kick them. <laughs> Kick them. Oh, they don't look that bad. Kick them in the dishpan. Roo, roo, roo. It's woo, woo, woo. It's roo, roo, roo if you're Scooby-Doo like the episode. That, that's fucking... That's a Courage the Cowardly Dog episode. Oh, was it? Oh, yeah. okay. Okay, Courage then. Yeah, you kick him in the dishpan. Woo, woo, woo. God, these things are fucking... Spooky. Oh, spooky damage. Yeah. Okay, yeah, this this was probably a bad idea. This... <laughs> I'm gonna run. <laughs> uh, I mean, can you? Is there... Yeah, even... surrender. Giving up is the same as losing. Oh, no. No, at least try. All right. Yeah. Oh no, why did you attack a different one? Because I'm gonna fucking kill this one with her. She's got the stronger attack though. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Yeah, I bet. I probably should have listened to the game, that was a mistake. You got your ass kicked all the way up the stairs. You gain an effect, angry. You get so angry about losing that fight that you pass out. Susie must have carried you back here after you got knocked out. You're a little sore, but not otherwise worth any worse for wear. You are pretty hungry though and sober. Yep. Let's mosey! God, it's only been day two. So Good you Lord. lost a lot of buffs. That's fine. Well, you can make yourself angry on purpose, which makes you stronger, but then you 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 know you run the risk of the... Well, that's fine. I mean, that's yeah. gonna happen. You call yourself a good-for-nothing yellow-footed jerk! Yep. Saw yourself again. Yeah, don't go beyond two, though. So if I do that a third time, I just pass out. Yes, that's fucking great. I love it. All right, let's go. Let's go back to the the missionary. Actually, let's let's get some some bourbon. I'll have a shot of bourbon. Hmm. All right, see you later, Lloyd. Because I know that was one of the things I I had on me. Yeah, that was just that specific one. You can drink any kind of. Stuff. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, I, I can just drink other ones. Item is using combat, 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 cow blood. Like 25, but you shouldn't drink it. Yes, because that's an evil thing. Clown knife. Oh, that's better than the one I've got. Yeah, it is. Fuck yeah, equip the, cl the, the clown knife. Increases your muscle, mysticality, and moxie by 5 for the rest of the day. Can I just 
eat a bunch of shit and just get all of this, or can you I? You can. Like... Uh, uh, but so so you so you've got th that's where oh, the, the spleen, stomach, and liver. Okay, yeah. So, so so you could eat two food items for we'll stomach. Eat, we'll eat one of those. And then the liver, you already drank a thing. And then spleen, you get from other stuff. You, there, there, something else is for spleen. You pry open the can with your bare hands because you don't have time for a can opener, and eat the meat. It tastes way better than you expected it to. You gain an effect meted out. I'll be darned. Let's see, where's where's food? Potions is probably your spleen. Ah, uh, okay. Let's see. You got dusty turnip, a hard tack. This cracker is definitely optimized for shelf life instead of taste. Yep, hard tack is awful. No, I know. I, I've watched someone make it before. Oh, really? They yeah, still no, it, make it? Well, because, like, some... some God, what is, what is that old meal that, like, soldiers used to eat back in the day? It was, like, hard tack and something else. Gruel? I don't know. I don't think it was... Gruel. I mean, hard tack was eventually replaced with MREs, with, like, the military rations. Let's see. Cow tongue. I don't need mysticality. That would be nice, though. Let's eat a Vienna blood sausage. You eat the sausages, which vivify your veins with the vigor of a Viennese vampire. Wonderful. God damn it. Dirt bourbon, and then potions are what your spleen is, I think. Mm. So that laudanum, you need to give to someone. Oh, because I'll hold on to that. Mm. Can't drink that. That's cow bile. Mm. All the cow things you don't want. Stardust. Oh, no, save that for a ritual. Uh, yeah, I guess I can't. I don't have anything for, thing for spleen then, so I guess we're good. Yep. Uh, so, so you're There's actually in the right. Coffee, do though. Oh, speed. Uh, so uh, there is it's old man. You give the laudanum him. So man stares off into the distance, listening to the piano. He doesn't react to you at all. Let's try again. No. Nope. What the fuck? I guess it's not him. It might be a different old man. Oh. I thought for sure it was that guy. Maybe there's something you have to do to, like, wake him up or something? Ghost. Comb her mane. She neighs with whispery gratitude. Alright, we'll go to Danny Stannery in a minute. I, I was busy doing something the fuck else. Before Stefan didn't stop me from doing making a bad decision. Oh, hell yeah. That she's she cross paths with Wander and Sally again. Hell yeah, see what she got. She's you got bet. different stuff every time. <clears throat> You know what? But we'll, we'll, we'll see what she has on the next episode of Deep Fried Boys.